Hey there. Okay, so I am going to make my favorite drink. This is the best summer drink on the planet, in my opinion. Um, so it's called a dirty margarita. And the first time I had it, I was actually at a party and the host offered it to me. And I said, well, what makes it dirty? And she said, the person drinking it. <laughs> so anyways, um, you can call it whatever. I've heard it called slap your mama. I've heard it called beer garitas. You can call it whatever you want. Um, I should tell you, I don't like margaritas so much and I don't like beer, but I love this drink. So um, I want to show you our quick stir pitcher. This is our small one. Uh, and I'm just going to make it in the small one because I like it so much. It would not be good if I made it in the large one because then I would just keep drinking. And it is an alcoholic beverage, so I need moderation, of course. So this is just a can of frozen limeade that I'm going to dump in. And then add a Corona. I've heard some people do like Bud Light Lime as well. And then it's vodka and Sprite, and then that's it. And then you just mix it up and serve it on ice. So I just take this cup and measure, up. I'm a little bit embarrassed to show you guys this thing of vodka. I've never bought a thing of vodka this big in my life and it makes me feel like not super awesome. Um, but I figured this will be like, you know, when we have parties and things like that, then I'll have it for this recipe. So I just measure this about half full and dump it in and then top it off with like Sprite or um, limeade or some, you know, ginger ale, that kind of a thing. And then you just put the top on and the cool thing about the quick stir pitcher is you can just mix it up without getting a spoon out, right? You just plunge, plunge, plunge it up. So I don't really measure, I just kind of top off with the pop. Okay. so. This is great, um, you know, if you want to mix up your Crystal Light, if you want to mix up um, Kool-Aid, orange juice, like concentrate, that kind of thing. And again, we do have the family size, which is twice as big, if you're interested in that. And this has the measurements on it. This goes up to two quarts. Um, now, this is what I like to drink it out of. So this is our wine tumbler. Don't be fooled by the name. You can put anything in here. So I was up at about 5 a.m. I needed some Coke, right? These are all my bad habits, you guys. Coca-Cola and dirty margaritas. Oh my gosh. Anyways, um, and it was a hot day here today. We're talking, it was 85 outside and probably about the same upstairs. So I had this in my office and I had ice in it and Coke. And I just went up there to grab it. So it's been over 12 hours that this has been sitting up there. And I don't know if you can hear, there's still ice in here, you guys. So I'm just gonna dump this out and show you. I'll show you the ice that's still in here. Obviously it melted a little bit, but look at how much ice is still in here from 12 hours ago on a hot summer day. So this really does a fantastic job of keeping um, liquids cold or hot. So you can also use this, you know, for hot tea or hot chocolate or coffee or that kind of thing. Um, and it comes with the lid. So you have the little pour spot in here. We've got metal straws that will fit in here if you want to use that. Um, and this silicone just helps so it doesn't slide around and it stays kind of room temperature on the outside. It wasn't cold to the touch. It doesn't get hot to the touch. Um, I can't say enough about these. I love them for whatever it is that you happen to be drinking. Okay, so I'm gonna run because I'm gonna have myself a little drink here. Um, but you guys, I hope that you have an awesome night and that you enjoy this fun summer drink. Bye.